Fall festival season is in bloom, and this weekend families can head out to Ella J and pick their own apples. Fox News Jonathan Stacy is live from Hillcrest Orchards Orchids with more. Jonathan. Good afternoon to you, Christine. We are here live at Hillcrest Orchards and the beautiful city of LJ. We stepped outside into the country right off of Georgia 52 there. And it's a place where families have been coming not only as we've entered into the fall season, but really in September is when they started apple picking out here. And you can still see that there are a number of apples on the trees that you can come out and get likely for the next three or four weeks. They'll have plenty to pick from here. However, there is one thing that the owner, Janice, is telling me that needs to happen and the weather for these kind of pale apples to really brighten up. And we'll tell you about that coming up at 5 o'clock. Now, what they were able to get a lot of in the spring and summertime was a lot of rain. However, over the past really month, month and a half, rainfall has been hard to come by here. And that's not a major surprise. Here in Georgia, September and October are our driest months. But we've been a little bit too dry as of late. In fact, for the year, since January 1st, we're now running a deficit of over five inches of rainfall. That's at Atlanta's Hartsville Jackson International Airport. And when you look at Northwest Georgia specifically here, looking at the rainfall deficit over the past 30 days. Now the area shaded in red indicates that you're running behind on about three inches of rainfall. And that's when we look at the drought monitor and it really starts to paint a clearer picture here. That's where we're starting to see those abnormally dry conditions. Uh, the yellow shading indicating that you're abnormally dry, but upping the ante when you see the brown shading areas here. So that means that we do need some rainfall and it doesn't look like there are any really stout fronts that are going to come through and bring us some moisture. So when we get a new drought monitor report out on Thursday, it will likely show that conditions as far as the drought is concerned have worsened not only across northwest Georgia, but as we look further to the south of town in between I-75 and I-85, we're already starting to see some abnormal drought conditions building there. So we do need some rain to come, but we don't want it to come, especially Especially on the weekends when you can come here to Hillcrest Orchards and do some good apple picking. Once again, we need the weather to take a bit of a change, and we'll talk about that at 5 o'clock. Until then, we're live in LJ, Jonathan Stacy, Fox 5 News. Nice, need those apples to be nice and red and juicy. <laughs> I bet people have a lot of fun That's the color weekend. we're looking for. Yeah.